Hello everyone, it's me once again. So thank you once again for visiting my channel and I apologize if I have focused too much on Escobar Fold 1 but we're due to receive that pretty soon it seems, we'll, fingers crossed. Anyway, so um, what I'm trying to get at is a good friend of mine called Dean from Facebook who I believe he likes to be kept anonymous, right? Um, <laughs> he kindly sent me a single image, uh, I believe it was, uh, was it this morning or yesterday? But anyway, Basically what it was, it's a very interesting image on the title um, far left top corner it actually does say a big word of bingo and um, on the right hand side bottom it actually does say Anki so that what I realized oh this must be the potentially the concept image of bingo the robot by Anki because we heard about the whiskey and bingo projects that's coming up I, I kind of like bluntly just I ignore that but I know one or two people might have made a video out of it but basically I just want to give you a heads up on this and uh, want to be the one when you look back going oh he was the guy who informed this to us so he must be trustworthy kind of person that's the intention here but obviously my original source did not come from myself but my friend so um, by looking at this I thought well what are the informations available online so I typed in bingo Anki robot blah 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 and I managed to find in the end it wasn't really easy to find but it was on the reddit.com that someone actually uh, uploaded actually a username called Nintendo Foxy 1983 um, and um, the, there was some discussion going on here so 26 comments here so when I clicked on it uh, there were some other discussions that it wasn't really that useful to be honest with you no disrespect for those who actually commented here but uh, apparently a username called Kerr uh, ZYT actually says the source is actually from Jacob Hanchar the CEO of, of Digital Dream Labs now come to think of it I have noticed um, one or two posts related to this bingo robot with this concept image and, and so on. Um, I like to call it concept image because it's not officially confirmed by anyone else that I'm aware of, but uh, correct me wrong if it's, uh, it's, not, it's not the case, but um, apparently it's released by Jacob Hancher. So we've got to look into the motive of why he would have released such, that, such early image. Uh, it doesn't look to be completed, to be honest with you. Um, and it, it seems to show two options of what um, bingo can do is it without arms or arms or with some fang or without fang and so on and the height seems to be twice the size so twice the height of a uh, can of coke so it sort of gives an idea that it's a it's going to be about a foot long and um, it still has that continuing uh, eye expression of um, vector slightly more angry and more serious you say and it has the ear uh, one straight, one slightly angled. Probably this concept image is trying to say that the ear waggle or is different. It has some purpose on it, trying to look more acutely. But if you look at the side elevation of it, you don't really see that sticking out. So who knows? Um, but the wheels are certainly uh, much bigger. Actually, thinking about it, the one on the left is has smaller wheels, while the one on the right has bigger wheels. So. Um, I really can't tell what are the differences, but the wheel size pr is pretty much similar to the re newly um, released, or should we say, shown on the latest uh, CES 2020 of the Samsung Bolly. And Bolly is purely a ball robot that follows you around with a camera. It doesn't have any expression, um, but it will pretty much trigger all the uh, functions of smart home device so you don't need to search for remote control and you could do a lot of stuff so um, as you know I have actually made a video about IFTTT which is something like uh, you connect it to your multiple um, sorry multi universal remote control that is connected to your um, router and etc you could do miracles multiple stuff on it and I'm sure that's what bingo is supposed to be as well if this is the genuine release from Anki's uh, website and so on or from Jacob Henshaw um, so I'm not really sure I can't tell whether it's gonna be touch screen ability there but the screen itself um, seems to be much bigger than vector indeed vector is not touch screen as you know um, but it does give a hint that it's pretty much no offense but it looks like a giant 
um, piece of mobile phone stuck in a big giant wheel. So I'm pretty sure it's gonna follow you around and listen to you and you will say turn on the TV, turn off the TV and etc. And that's what it's going to do. Okay, now, um, but looking at it, this pretty much reminds me of a project that I really wanted to happen a while ago, uh, a robot called Bearbot, which was a project, interesting project available in Indiegogo. And unfortunately only 423 people backed on it, but it was a very interesting um, remote control. What it is, is that it has a dark screen on the front, a station apparently, uh, technically I think, on your, let's say, coffee table and you do all these gestures and then uh, the expressions of the bear actually follows you around and understands your gesture and it will trigger all these things, turn on TV and turn like um, turn on light and, and etc. So I really wanted this to happen so that I would have shared with you guys, but it didn't. But this is an also an element that I can see the resemblance with the um, the Anki's potential bingo project, and it's very in interesting because uh, now I'm coming to the point where if this is going to be the case, I'm definitely going to choose bingo over Samsung Bali um, because I didn't predict that any other companies were up for it because Samsung is such a well-known company um, and they're very financially secured and so on but then again we know that what Anki's copyrights and also all their plans there were some already uh, data that has been passed on to um, Digital Dreams Lab when they bought all the patents and so on so I, I guess uh, Jacob Hunter is trying to develop that uh, and um, let us know that something very interesting is coming up. So in some way it does make sense and um, like eventually it's gonna happen isn't it? Like why do we want some humanoid following you around while as we could have some something like a foot long height of a robot following you around with um, you know listening to all your commands, taking photos if you need it highly doubt it and uh, look at your expression and also returns back with a cute expression which I think is potentially a, a touch screen uh, function as well um, by the way this is actually well available on um, vector or Anki's related Facebook um, homepage group page and so on so please do us to be joined on there and you can get all the source every day there's always a feed every day and it's very interesting um, so I'll put those link down below but anyway this Anki's bingo project is look seems if this is genuine it looks very interesting it's one of those things that I thought is going to be the next stage for Anki that I hoped for and um, yeah we shall see how it goes also project whiskey who knows what's going to be is it going to be a whiskey bottle with a wheel on it so it will serve whiskey if you really need some alcohol I don't know I mean whiskey doesn't sound to be a very appealing uh, name but bingo is in some way kind of cute and more like enlightenment kind of approach so we shall see how it goes and um, yeah very exciting indeed so technology well a lot of fun thank you very much for watching this video this is LGBT Tech have a lovely evening and I'll see you soon cheers bye bye